Shalom. The real Hebrew Israelites are blacks, Hispanics, and Native American Indians. All right, first and foremost, I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakah Kodash. All right, double honors to the elder apostles of Great Millstone. The salutation and blessing to you, Aki, that's pushing this word of truth and sincerity. All right, and today's lesson is uh, going to be me proving that the names are Yahweh, why Yahweh Shai. Okay, I'm going to be proving it through the scriptures. All right. This is Exodus chapter 3 and verse 14. And, and, uh, and Yahweh said unto Moses, I am that I am. Okay? So Yahweh said to Moses, I am that I am. All right? So if, if, if I was to say, I am that I am, you would say, he is. Okay? Well, if I was to say, um, uh, uh, if, if my little brother was to ask me, uh, uh, if, if I was to say uh, I am hungry you know and then I told my brother to go tell my mother that he would go say that uh, he is hungry alright he would go and say yeah uh, he he's hungry alright you wouldn't say I'm hungry alright it's not proper man alright and it says and he said uh, thus, thus said Thus said, uh, thou, thou say unto the children of Israel, I am have sent me unto you. All right. So the Lord was, uh, the Lord said to go tell them that I am, uh, uh, ha have sent me unto you. So you, so Moses will go and say, he is, has sent me unto you. Okay. And that's what the name, uh, Yahweh means. He is, he is existence. All right. And it says, and Yahweh said, moreover, unto Moses, thus, uh, thus shalt thou say unto the children of Israel, Yahweh, power of our fathers, uh, the power of Abraham, the power of Isaac, the power of Jacob, have sent me unto you. This is my name forever, and this is my memorial unto all generations. All right? So, Yahweh has one name, one name under the heaven, man, okay? It said forever, okay? And it says, uh, it's a memorial to all generations, man, all generations of Israel, okay? He does not change. Um, Yahweh, I change not, all right? The Lord, the Lord doesn't change, okay? Um, I'm going to get a precept, uh, Genesis Chapter, let me see, Genesis, oh, sorry. Let me see. Genesis chapter 4 and verse 26, and Seth to him also there was born a son and he called his name Enos, then began, and then, then began men to call upon the name of Yahweh, okay? So men began to uh, began to call upon that name Yahweh, man. Okay, he is. All right. Uh, let me get a precept. This is Genesis chapter thirty-two. Let's see how I do this. Genesis chapter 32 and verse 28. And he said, Thy name shall be shall be called no more uh, Jacob, but Israel. For as a prince hast thou power with Yahweh, and with men has prevailed. Okay? So his name was changed to Israel because he's a prince of power. Alright, man? You know? Prince of power, man. He's a prince, he's a prince uh, to Yahweh. All right. Uh, I'm gonna get Genesis chapter twenty nine and verse thirty five. Uh, and she conceived again and bare a son, and she said, "Now will I praise Yahweh." Therefore, she called his name Judah, and left bearing. All right. So um, that. 
that name uh, Judah is Yahweh in the Hebrew, okay, which means uh, praise Yahweh, okay, you know, so um, yeah, man, you know, so it, it, it it's pray it's to praise Yahweh, man, you know, just like that Genesis said, you know, um, it started the uh, for men to start to call on the name of Yahweh, okay. So they start to call on that name. All right. Um, I'm going to get Hebrews chapter 11. Hebrews chapter 11 verse 1. Now faith is a substance of things hoped for the evidence of things not seen. All right. I'm going to jump to verse 6. But without faith, it is impossible to please him, for he that cometh to Yahweh must believe that he is. Okay? So you have to believe that Yahweh, uh, that Yahweh is. Okay? You have to believe that he is. He is existence, man. All right? You have to believe that that's his name. Not Jesus Christ. Uh, not God. All right? Not um, uh, Yeshua and Jehovah and all these other names, man. Okay, you have to believe that his name is Yahweh. All right, he is. All right, it's a name that's that uh that's his name forever, man, to all generations. Okay, um, wait a minute. and it says, and that he is a rewarder of them that diligently seek him. Okay, so man, we diligently seek seek uh Yahweh, he's gonna reward us, man. All right, now our ultimate reward is going to be that kingdom of heaven, Yahweh Okay? Um, I'm going to go to uh, the book of Sirach, chapter 4, verse 8. Sirach, chapter 43, and verse 27. We may speak much and yet come short. Wherefore, in some... He is all, okay? Yahweh is all, man. Yahweh is in everything. Yahweh is. He is, okay? Simple. Now, um, I'm going to move on to the name of Yahweh Shine, okay? Let me see. Slide here. This is Matthew chapter 1. In verse 21. And she and she shall bring forth a son, and thou shalt call his name Yahweshai, for he shall save his people from their sins. Okay? So his name is not Jesus, man. Alright, his name is Yahweshai, which means he is salvation. Okay? So he is gonna save his people, like it just said in the scriptures. Okay? Matthew uh, 1 and 21. Alright? And read over. And she shall bring forth a son, and thou shalt call his name Yahawashai, for he shall save his people from their sins. Alright? And that's exactly what Yahawashai means. Salvation. Alright? He's going to save his people, man. Okay? Uh, um, I'm going to get Acts chapter 7, verse 44. Uh, this is Acts chapter 7. It's Acts chapter 7 and verse 44. Our fathers uh, had, had the tabernacles of the wilderness, of the witness in the wilderness, as he had appointed speaking unto Moses. All right, so this is this is talking about the Old Testament, that he should make it according to the fashion that he has seen, which also our fathers that came after brought in with Yahawashai, and to the possessions of the Gentiles, whom Yahweh drave out before the face of our father unto the days of David. Okay, so who is this Yahweh Shai talking about? That's talking about Joshua. All right, Joshua and uh, Yahweh Shai had the same exact name. All right, the one who y'all call Jesus Christ. All right, Joshua and Jesus had the same name. All right, which was Yahweh Shai. All right, because they saved their people. Right, but uh, Joshua didn't fully fulfill that name, 
okay? Because uh, Yahweh Shai, all right, the one uh, in the New Testament, all right, is going to save us from all of our sins, all right? He is that ultimate savior, all right? Uh, Joshua led us uh, into the promised land, man, okay? He, he saved us from, um, you know, basically the wilderness, okay? Uh, I'm going to get Hebrews... Hebrews 4 and uh, 